What is up, everybody? Welcome back. So I'm going to show you guys the easiest way to get badges. Maybe you guys just got the game. Most of you guys know the method by now. But it's pretty simple. So I'm going to show you, in my opinion, the best way. There's multiple ways that you can do this. But most of you guys are going to be like, Give, we already know this. Cool. Congratulations. You know the method. Awesome. But what I'm going to do, and this is my... method of getting the most XP points for your shooting or whatever but if you're a p guy that sets screens like a popper or just a spot-up shooter here's the badges that I recommend and I'll get to that in a minute but I think these drills are literally the best so I just I don't repeat any drill I just continuously go at it Yes, I do use the shot meter. Yes, it is an ugly jumper. But if you get three stars on these, it's going to be really, really simple. Not with my jumper, though. It's freaking terrible. Just don't mind the jumper. It's bad. Get the ball, dude. What are you doing? But yeah, pretty much all you want to do is just get three stars in this. It's not that hard. And I'm going to show you guys the amount of XP that you get from this. If I ever get the ball. The one thing that I don't like about this year's game is... A lot of people can disagree is... How difficult the shooting is this year. I mean, yes... You have to green every single shot pretty much, but... It is about time. Like, I'm 50-50 on it. So, look at that. Plus 4,200. Just for doing one drill. I appreciate it. Now, gotta go talk to him again. We're just gonna go to... Let's do this one. So, pretty much what happens in this drill is you just have to continuously. Right. That's true. But yeah, all you have to do is just literally go to the hot spot and get a higher score than him. So, I could just go. And go here. Like I said, don't mind the jump shot. Oh my god. Terrible. So we're just going to go right here, and then we go shooting again, uh, not the greatest, I kind of struggled a lot. But yeah, so pretty much I'm done there. Like I said, you guys are going to make fun of the jumper, I already know that's going to be a thing. But yeah, and then what you can do is talk to J. Cole, Tyler Hero, and all them. Apparently it's stuck. Hello? Alright, J. Cole, apparently I can't talk to you. Alright. Now, these games usually take like five minutes. It's not difficult at all. And you can just repeat this no matter what. So you can play with T-Mac. You can play with J. Cole. It's up to you. So, okay, I was going to try to fast forward this, but. All 
I did not call for the ball, but thanks. But I would say, like, a good way to just earn the XP is just freaking get at least, like, 15 points a game. And you should be all right. Like, if you're a point guard, obviously you want to do the playmaking badges and go from there. But as of right now, I just want this game to go fast so I can show you guys how much XP you get from this. But yeah, what I would recommend is just obviously do the team practices, do this, and you're on your way. If you don't want to play my career, this is what you should do. Well, no shit, GIF. Well, I'm just trying to help you guys out. So, I'm just going to stay, play this game, but if you for you spot-up shooters, the badges that I would recommend is catch and shoot, claymore, Guard up and corner specialist on Hall of Fame. And then for the other badges, I would recommend... Okay, he's not going to pass me the ball. All right. Recommend Deadeye, Limitless Range, Blinders, Green Machine, and Volume Shooter. So those are the shooting badges. If you're a spot up, that I would recommend. I'll make a video for guards tomorrow if you guys are interested. If not, then all right. Like I said, I mean, just trying to get this game to go as fast as possible. So. They're really going to double team me? Alright. But I'll also be posting the answers of, um... Like the music trivia and shit, I already posted the first one, so if you guys need help with that, you can check it out. So yeah, I know this jumper looks bad, guys. It is what it is, so. But yeah, so pretty much, like I said, I would recommend doing the drills. Running with J. Cole, or whoever, and going that route. Just going to show you guys how much XP you get from this. Like I said before. We'll go that route. Alright. All right, let's just end this game. And that's the game. Literally, these games take five, ten minutes tops get a couple fans from it but look at the XP you get like I said so you do the drills and then you just continuously play games here you're getting a good amount of XP from it so that would be my method for you guys but if you guys want to see the shooting badges that I have here's what I got I'm saving up for catch and shoot but I have Claymore Hall of Fame guard up Agent 3, and then 
Floor General, Killer Combo. Box Out Beast, all that. So yeah, guys, that is the method that I would recommend for you guys. If you don't want to play my career, I would just continuously do this. Spend 5-10 minutes, maybe listen to some music, and go that route. But if you guys have any other questions, let me know. I'm live on Twitch, or you can follow me on Twitter, at WolfpackGIF. And I will see you guys in the next one.